when you're with these girls, right? Mm -hmm. Do you look? Do you are you interested in them to know why, why they? You know, because I I tell you, I've never met girls like this. To be born with you know a Rolls Royce for flesh, <laughs> something <laughs> seriously, I would have probably given up many IQ points just to experience. So mm -hmm. it, it's the ultimate pinnacle for them to to to. Uh, clearly, they want to be in the magazine, mm -hmm. but are they using you for fame? To some extent. And, sure. and you don't mind? I don't mind at all. <laughs> God, are you liberated? I mean, <laughs> when they sleep with you, do you fantasize that they love you? Some of them do. I think that in all relationships, you get something very romantic and, and intense in the very first part of the relationship. Always. And then it begins to disappear. How many times And then in? you just become used to one another and accommodate to one another mm. and bored with one another, and you either stay married or you don't. I mean, that's the way it is in most relationships. That's the nature of things. People, may, it, It's not politically correct, but it's, it's the real world. I deal in the real world, even though I'm a romantic. And, and these freak incidents where people are together and they marry and you see them as old people sitting on a bench mm -hmm. and they're, you know, senile together. Mm -hmm. Do you think those are the freaks? No, not at all. I, Do don't think, I, I think there are fewer freaks on the planet than we assume. But I mean, there, there are many roads to Mecca. Yeah. Many ways to find happiness. Many dreams.